Hi everybody, this is Johnny here on Gillen Farms. The task at hand today is uh, we're going to seed the pasture. We're going to seed all that ground that uh, that I've been working on for weeks at this point now. Uh, I think we've got it to a point where we can put the seed to it. So uh, yeah, let's get started doing that.
do some more gotta do some more rock mashing <laughs> here are the frogs very warm today and uh tomorrow it's gonna be in the low 30s 70 today low 30s tomorrow oklahoma contact Everything seeded and then and then I came in and I tracked over everything with the dozer again and what that was to do was to not only hide rocks but it was also to uh, to use the tread to push that seed into the soil we have a really good shot at rain tonight and uh, so you know with the rain putting it uh, the seed out getting it in the soil getting some warm temperatures this should start popping pretty soon um so we're you know of course creating pasture for the cattle now the reason i feed up in this area up here is uh, this is where i've been doing all the dozing i feed up here so that the cattle actually help me by tromping that seed into the ground up in here and uh also they uh fertilize it for me i mean you can see it right here they have they have really put the fertilizer to this seed up here. So all the way around this, you can see, you know, the cow manure. The cow manure is great fertilizer. So, so not, they're trampling it in. The leftover hay, which <laughs> like I said, there's not much leftover hay. There's some, but not a whole lot. The leftover hay also seeds the ground so there's seed in that hay and it 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 helps it helps this ground up here it also creates organic matter for this uh, to create this pasture up here so you know i've got a plan and the plan is coming together so you know <laughs> who doesn't like to watch cattle eat old danny over there he's a He's chowing down, washing his gals. But we should have a couple of new babies here pretty soon. And we got a couple of cows here that are they're getting really close. And and you know, this has kind of been one of those things we just wanted to 
bring back, which was uh, cattle on the, on the old Gillum homestead from way back. Like I said, I grew up out here. And whenever I was a kid, I helped my dad chase cattle all over this place. Um, used to have a hay barn up on that hill up there. And I remember many a time going out there and and uh, and helping him hay the cattle or going out there and haying the cattle. Um, <laughs> it's just it's just one of those things from my past. Uh, and we're bringing it back. Getting ready to got this all ready for the fence to come through. So there's going to be a cross fence right here, just to kind of. What that's going to do is that's going to help uh, help to where we can have this pasture over here, of course. Have this pasture back over here, and then, of course, the pasture where the mean girls are, which I've talked about many times. So, getting ready to probably move the dozer in a few days. i got to cut a little road back over here, uh, but, you know, I'm getting to the end of the dozing on this, on this property until at least until it dries up enough to where I can build the ponds. So if you like this type of video, like and subscribe, and uh, we'll continue to bring more content. And as always, everybody, God bless. Until next time, thank you.